Hi guys, welcome to my coffee shop. My name is Jack and I have an issue with my niche duo. Or I had an issue with my niche duo and I will show you how to fix it. Oof, what a week it was, guys. It, you won't gonna believe it. I will tell you during this video. But let's start from the beginning. Niche Zero, at some point, that has been the most popular single dose grinder for home baristas. And not without the reason. That was a perfect grinder. Relatively affordable, nice coffee you get out of it. And at the time, the workflow on this one was like no others and ever since I got niche zero I was hoping for something else from niche and we have been waiting for a long time until April 2023 when they introduced niche duo and I pre-ordered it immediately I have no idea what I was hoping for but what we got is um, well something that at least outside it looks exactly the same as niche zero just bigger the look some people like it some people hate it I won't comment on that what's inside we've got 83 millimeter flat bars great those bars very popular we got 130 watts of power engine but that's a geared engine does not struggle with the coffee at all although the grind experience you especially for espresso you have to wait like 25 seconds for 18 grams of coffee but still that's okay what are the innovations what are the new technologies what the step forward ahead of competition that niche duo offered not much apart from one bit the reason it's called niche duo it comes with two sets of bursts I mean you can order with one but it comes with two sets of bursts one for espresso one for pour over and those bursts they sit on a burst carriers and that allows you to swap in between in less than 60 seconds and yes it is a very simple process my approach to grinders is probably slightly different than yours the main reason I bought niche duo is for you guys I was expecting it to be a very popular grinder I wanted to record videos for you I wanted to get millions of views and become a YouTube superstar that obviously hasn't happened yet but another thing is that I like to experiment with my coffee I like to compare different bursts and so on and as I said 83 millimeter bursts are very popular bursts so you can upgrade to let's say SSP bursts you have choice of one two three I think or four and there are other companies as well by the way I'm not sure if niche recommends or advice against upgrading the bursts but recently I bought this so those are SSP multi-purpose bursts 83 millimeter bursts I was waiting long time for them they are bloody expensive so eventually I managed to find them second hand and I was actually recording a video for you I was swapping the bursts and what happened and during that process the teeny tiny pin out of the bottom burk area came out until then I never even knew there is that pin over there and it helps to secure the burst into the shaft of the grinder so it came off I tried to push it back in I was struggling so what I did I contacted Nish to their credit they responded in like 30 minutes and their advice was I will put it on the screen somewhere they said use the pencil that's how we do it pencil 2024 who the hell own pencils anymore I mean I might be wrong I haven't checked it but uh, I haven't seen anywhere in the manual the requirement of having a pencil to maintain this grind anyway I found apple pencil I tried to push it in many attempts one of them ending up with me dropping that pin behind the couch in front of me honestly I was so furious I was so upset and even if I managed to push it back then each time I tried to assemble and disassemble the grinder it was coming off again and again and again and honestly I had enough at this point I thought I'm selling the niche not only that I recorded a video very passionate video saying how bad the niche duo is and how bad the experience and the customer service and everything else and I hate niche and never never buy niche again <sighs> and then I sent another email to them this one they hasn't replied then that was a weekend so then on Monday I sent another one this time they did reply and they say yeah okay we're going to send you replacement of that bottom back area that's fine okay okay so I calmed down a little bit I removed some of the stronger bits out of that video I was still upset everything was ready for you guys just the finishing touches and the next day they send me another message this time they actually sent me a video how to put that pin back and get Guess what you don't need a pencil no pencil required I will show you how to do it all you need to do is take off the burr take off that plastic cover from the top of the burr area and then you have nice access to that pin and then you can push it with the finger and it works yeah and now my niche is working nicely so obviously I wasted four days not being able to use the niche just for the niche to eventually show me how to do it properly so kind of mixed reaction here with the customer service on one hand apart from one email they were 
responding very quickly and eventually they actually send me a video to show exactly how to do it so well, yeah that's perfect but why it took them four or five days and why they gave me that well if not wrong then very very misleading information at the very beginning eventually they did apologize to me in another email but still it leaves me kind of uncertain the good news is that my niche is working if you ever encounter the same issue and you probably will at some point if you change the burst just watch to the video again and you will have a solution let me know what you think about that whole situation anyway if you reach to this part of the video you may as well click like consider even subscribing to the channel normally i'm probably slightly less animated what we do here we compare grinders we compare brew methods i have lots of new products i bought another blind shaker this time for my lapavoni so we will play it at some point pesado kindly sent me the high extraction filter basket i'm testing it as we speak Cafmasino graciously they sent to me all of the high extraction filter baskets the new baskets they also sent me the pack screen so we're going to play with that in the future but for today thank you very much for watching my name is jack this is my coffee show and hopefully i will see you soon thank you bye